if uh, today the only difference is that we're going to have high fire danger. Yesterday was almost a picture perfect day. Look at that. We topped off at 76 degrees or we should be at 78 degrees uh, for this time of year. But uh, I say goodbye to the 70s because we're going to be heading into the 80s, not only for today, but going on into the weekend and early next week as well. But we still have a cool air mass that's in place, folks. So it's still a little bit on the chilly side. 52 degrees, a southwesterly wind at 11 miles per hour. It's uh, ranging to 42 over in Kingsville as well as in Premont, 45 in Alice. 46 in Orange Grove, as well as up the road in Three Rivers, but 57 off in Ingleside and Arantes Pass at 55, even 54 out at the Naval Air Station. So as we look at the hour by hour forecast, another round of sunshine is expected again. It's going to be a fantastic day for us here, but again, notice how those temperatures getting up into those lower 80s and look at those uh, northwesterly winds that will be coming in right around 15 to 25 miles an hour. So afternoon highs for today are going to be into the 70s and 80s across the region. Again, about 82 here in Corpus Christi. 78 in Aransas Pass and getting into those lower 80s from George West Freer and over towards Orange Grove and Alice. So again, with the extra wind for today, yesterday it was pretty moderate out there and things were looking good. But today we're going to turn that dial up a little bit more from high to very high over most of South Texas. So again, the National Weather Service has issued red flag warnings, fire weather warnings, anywhere you see that pink. So everyone is included. That begins later on this morning and until uh, last to about 8 o'clock this evening. So again, do your part to keep the fire danger at bay, dispose of cigarette butts properly, don't park in tall grass, that sort of thing, and anything with sparks and flames, keep those at a minimum. So small craft advisories are also in effect for the bays near shore waters, and here's why the fire danger is so bad. Relative humidity, the forecast later on this afternoon, single digits, very dry air, kind of unusual for South Texas. It picks up in the overnight hours, so that helps things, but then as we head into tomorrow as well, we just continue to have very dry air that continues to be in place. So that's why when we talk about fire danger and we have the dry air and uh, we get these fire goings, it's really difficult for the fire folks to put those out. So you see the extra wind for today calming down a little bit for tomorrow. That's some good news, but then Saturday and Sunday, those pick back up once again. Bays are choppy right now, seas two to five feet, and the uh, rip current risk is going to be low to moderate out there. High tide for Bob Hall Pier, Porter Ranches Jetty, into the early afternoon, Nueces Bay and Packery Channel. We're talking about later on this evening. So putting everything together, folks, again, high fire danger today. It's still going to be gorgeous out there, 82. Another chilly start tomorrow, 44 and 86. Friday, 85 on Saturday, but windy over the weekend. Even more wind early next week, highs into the 80s, and a small chance of a few showers late Tuesday and on into Wednesday. Paula.